Hey guys, Shay with the White Heat and Chris from Hawaii. Hey Chris with the White Heat. We're coming to you with a market report from the flight levels. We're at uh, 16,500 feet on our way home from a couple of visits in the uh, LA Monterey area. And we were just discussing the market and uh, my lack in getting a market report out to you. So we, we just we talked through the market today. So we'll start there. Uh, go ahead, Chris. Well, we were in uh, Los Banos. Uh, last uh, three days looking at our onion crop. Uh, we have uh, this week and uh, all of next week to uh, finish harvest and to finish packing down there of our yellows and reds. Uh, we think the market there is like in the neighborhood of dollars on uh, yellows and maybe nine dollars on uh, twenty-five jumbo reds. Okay, yeah, and uh, we've got about another, yeah, like Chris was saying, about 10 days there. I think in the general, most of the California guys are, at least in the Central Valley, are trying to get done. Uh, they see the Northwest coming and knocking on the door, and uh, the transition, I think, will be pretty clean for the most part. Not perfect, it never is, but it'll be uh, relatively clean. Uh, you are seeing that variation from 9 to 10 on jumbos. On the yellows, I think based on the difference uh, in harvesting practices, those of us that are doing hand harvest have got to get a little bit more just to cover the difference in cost. So um, you'll continue to see that. And uh, so the what are you hearing out of Washington? What about start dates for Washington? I'm Anything? not posted up there yet, but we're going to have uh, Idaho uh, are ready for uh, shipment in about 10 days. Uh, new crop, uh, not very many, but the quality looks real nice up there. We got some new early varieties that are uh, should have some really good skin. Those will start, um, yeah, like a, we'll, we'll start harvesting on a really small level this upcoming week. Ramp up and be going uh, within uh, seven to ten days. So uh, the outlook there, price-wise, I think we're going to see the status quo for a while. Uh, the pricing has been good. Volumes are good. Um, certainly, there's lots of volatility and changes out there, but for the time being, I don't think there's any reason to hit the panic button. Uh, transportation has been pretty. Decent, actually, in general. Uh, that's kind of a, a plus, out of uh, at least out of the Los Banos area. I know New Mexico's had some challenges, and I frankly don't know when those guys are going to be done. I mean, the guys that we're talking to, uh, I know we're, we're, you know, had the intent to finish early. Do you know any numbers out of there? Not yet. Okay. So, uh, not going to be a ton of help to you there, but that's uh, the, uh, the outlook for the, the time being. And uh, let us know if you need anything. We'll see you later.